Hello and welcome back to another video, today we will be going over 15 facts about the rise of ancient Rome. But before we start make sure to leave a like and subscribe, and turn on that notification bell so that you're notified when we next upload. And without further ado let's jump right into it. Number 1. Founding Myth According to legend, Rome was founded in 753 BCE by Romulus and Remus, twin brothers raised by a she-wolf. Romulus killed Remus and became the first king of Rome, establishing the city on the Palatine Hill. Number 2. The Early Kings Rome's early history was ruled by kings, with the first seven kings laying the foundations for Roman society, including its religious, political, and social institutions. Number 3. Transition to Republic In 509 BCE, Rome transitioned from a monarchy to a republic after the last king, Tarquin the Proud, was overthrown. The republic was characterized by a system of elected officials and a senate. Number 4. Roman Military Prowess Rome's rise was fueled by its formidable military, which was highly disciplined and adaptable. The Roman legions were a key factor in expanding and securing the empire's territories. Number 5. The Latin League Early in its history, Rome formed the Latin League, an alliance with neighboring Latin cities. This alliance helped Rome defend against external threats and expand its influence in the region. Number 6. Etruscan Influence The Etruscans, who lived to the north of Rome, greatly influenced early Roman culture, including religious practices, architecture, and engineering, such as the use of the arch. Number 7. Conquest of Italy Rome gradually conquered the Italian peninsula, defeating the Etruscans, Samnites, and Greek colonies in the south. By 270 BCE, Rome controlled most of Italy, setting the stage for further expansion. Number 8. Punic Wars Rome's victory in the Punic Wars, 264-146 BCE, against Carthage was a turning point, establishing Rome as the dominant power in the western Mediterranean and leading to the acquisition of key territories like Sicily, Spain, and North Africa. Number 9. Expansion into the Mediterranean Following the Punic Wars, Rome expanded into the eastern Mediterranean, conquering Macedonia, Greece, and Asia Minor, and establishing itself as a major Mediterranean power. Number 10. Roman Law and Governance The development of Roman law, including the Twelve Tables, provided a legal framework that contributed to Rome's stability and expansion by promoting order and justice throughout the growing empire. Number 11. Infrastructure and Engineering Rome's impressive infrastructure, including roads, aqueducts, and bridges, facilitated military movements, trade, and communication, helping to unify the empire and support its expansion. Number 12. The Roman Economy Rome's economy thrived on agriculture, trade, and slavery. The wealth generated by its conquests and a vast network of trade routes allowed Rome to finance further expansion and build its monumental architecture. Number 13. Cultural Assimilation Rome successfully assimilated conquered peoples by extending citizenship, integrating local elites into the Roman system, and spreading Roman culture, which helped maintain control over vast territories. Number 14. Rise of Powerful Generals Influential military leaders like Julius Caesar, Pompey, and Sulla gained power through their military successes, contributing to Rome's territorial expansion and ultimately transforming the political structure of the Republic. Number 15. Transformation into an Empire The rise of Rome culminated in its transformation from a republic to an empire. In 27 BCE, Augustus, formerly Octavian, became the first Roman emperor, marking the beginning of the Roman Empire and a new phase of expansion and consolidation. And that's it for today. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe and turn on that notification bell so that you're notified when we next upload. See you next time.